Excuse me, what are you doing? You packing? You're leaving me. You're leaving me, aren't you? <laughs> That's for a short time. Short time. Florida, right? Florida. Good morning, everyone. We are packing up Allison because tonight she leaves for Florida. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be good. Ooh, there was lightning way off in the distance. But in any case, we are sad to see her go, especially just because I just got back. All of you, the tribe here kind of spoke in the sense of the hashtag ALNFL. And so, Allison is gonna bring camera. Taking all your jewelry? Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't think you're coming back. You're, you're taking all the important shit. I'm definitely sad to see her go, but I'm excited that she's gonna have a good time with her mom. And, and it will give me the opportunity to kind of catch up on a lot of the videos that I've either wanted to shoot, have shot, and are waiting to be edited, or just more editing. Are you excited that mom's leaving? You get to hang out with dad the whole time? That does not look like a convincing face. I'm sitting here looking at the G7X and there's a, those little shrouds are pushing in, it's time for a new camera. I love the Canons. I'm always gonna be a Canon guy, I think. I'm not gonna go to the dark side of Team Sony, and I know my friends, Zoe and the Gots and Colin, you guys are giving me crap right now, but I, I'm a Canon guy, what can I say? Speaking of Canon guy, I watch a guy that, uh, his name is Peter McKinnon. He is based in Toronto, Canada, and he's just an incredibly talented guy. I, I aspire to be as knowledgeable of photography and the Adobe softwares and things like he is, but he, in a recent video of his, and I'll link that below in terms of some of the gear that all like creators should have with them. I'm not gonna do one myself because he did it way, way better, but, there was one little thing in particular that my mind just exploded. And like, I know most of you guys don't care about this, but this, this literally blew my mind. Right here is a body cap for the uh, Canon 70D. So this goes right smack on the front of the camera, like right where the lens would hook on. This guy is a lens end cap, right? So look how bad I'm peeling, guys. Oh my goodness. But like I was saying, this is a lens end cap. So the part of the lens that hooks onto the body of a DSLR. So those are the two pieces that you need for what I'm about to show you. So Peter blew my mind because you take the butt of this lens and you can say like, oh look, I have SD cards or whatever, you know, things you need to put in there. And you take the body cap, put it on here, and spin it. Guys, it's a freaking little container. It hooks onto itself. You can keep stuff in there. So when you're traveling, like I do with the vlog sometimes, that's amazing. That's amazing. It's just the stupid little things in life, like that. Like a little hack that you just wouldn't even think of. I wouldn't even thought to try to screw two lens caps together, but you can put little batteries in there, you can put micro SDs, you can put your SD cards. That one in particular that I just had was um, the uh, the card slot converter thing that you put a micro SD from like the drone or a GoPro so it can fit into an SD slot and a computer. Just stuff like that, I, I love that. <laughs> Two hours later. So we're off to a great start. I forgot to pack my shorts. <laughs> I had mostly dresses packed and I like obviously had tops, but I don't own a lot of pair of shorts that I really like. So I completely forgot to pack shorts, but since I'm going to Florida, obviously I want shorts. So I had to run home, but I got to see the babies one last time before I leave. And I'm gone for like 10 days. Oh, look at that, and that's so adorable. So I just ran home really fast on my lunch break um, to get my shorts, and now I have to pick up some food and head back to work. But excited for the work day to be over and to be relaxing on the beach.
What's up guys? I'm home from work and sadly without Allison. Stopped at the grocery store, got some groceries, but my plan tonight is I actually work. I've got so much work to do in terms of our consultancy, so we're trying to get that up and off the ground. So, Allison and I, I've, I actually this is a good this is a good opportunity to get you up to speed on some things in terms of where we're thinking. So like this gesture was like our career pro progression, if you will. I think the dream for Allison and I, right? I, I absolutely love working in the agency world. It's a love-hate relationship, it keeps me super busy. And I think I'm gonna spend a lot, a lot of time in that, right? I love it, we're going to Portland, it's super exciting. However, I think long term, so maybe even after I retire from uh, the agency world one day, right? Craziness to think about you know, retiring at my age, but I want to set up uh, a network, uh, a structure that allows us not only another stream of income, but also uh, allows me to continually learn doing some different things. And we've been we've been talking a lot about what like Allison's going to be doing, and there's some some updates on that that we'll we'll give to you in the future. But um, I really, really just want to have a network of professionals that we can tap into and conquer projects together. Kind of break the traditional like business model and I've got some really cool ideas for that and um, some phone calls over the next week or so that with some professionals that we can, we can set up something like that. So it's super exciting. Um, in terms of helping helping people and small businesses in particular, medium to small businesses out, um, has has really been a passion of mine. Um, as some of you guys know, I advise students and things like that that are in college, and um, really just being that sort of advisor consultant um, is something that I've I've really grown to love and enjoy, and definitely are going to continue to do that. That is exactly what my plan is. While Allison is gone, do more thinking to that. Get this place kind of cleaned up. You see, I've got some laundry. I have to do here and just get it just get it really really nice because Allison for me when I came home from Canada we didn't have that shot on the vlog but she was such a gem and it's just something about coming home to like a clean house so over the next week or so while she's gone obviously it's gonna be lived in and I'm dropping stuff everywhere like that right there we'll get that cleaned up made it It's it's super late, I'm really tired. I will show everyone more in the morning when you can actually see things, but good night. Whoa, oh my goodness. I like fell asleep on the couch for a little while. It was, it was just a long day at work today. I got some dinner, started watching some YouTube videos and just completely passed out. I was not. I was not, I got nothing done tonight. That's disappointing, considering I was just saying I was gonna do a bunch of stuff. So I was kind of standing here, and uh, do you ever start doing something, and then you kind of blink your eyes and realize that you've done a lot? I think that is sort of what I have going on with my sticky notes, I don't know. I'm pretty sure that is the most sticky notes I have ever put up in this general vicinity. I figured, hey, if I'm going to be home for the next week, especially this weekend because my weeks are very, very busy with work and with all the moving and stuff, I might as well just like brain dump all of the stuff that I have to do so I just spend the weekend doing. I mean. I love Allison, but the best part about Allison is I love to hang out with her. I love to spend time with her and just sit and talk and just do all of those things. But with her being away, I can really focus and get some stuff done. And I was actually writing most of these out and I'd be like, what I wouldn't give to actually have somebody come and just like stay with me for a week and then just pay them to do things. Because right now, I'm like getting to that point in my life where I, there are so many things I want to do, so many things that can make me money that I want to do, or at least like get Allison and I in a better spot, but I just literally don't have the time for them. And there was a time in my life where I didn't understand kind of the difference or why would someone pay someone to do that, but time is money. And uh, yeah, I'm going to be busy this weekend.
But I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog right here, guys. Thanks so much for sticking with us. Hope you had an awesome day today. Hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you are brand new, and we will see you tomorrow. And I struggled with that because Allison will see you from Florida, but I will see you from Chicago. Time to go. I love you guys. Bye.